What's in here? We'll go in there, man. Let's see what's up. Ooh, this sounds There's wonderful. There's someone in here. I can hear them. Can I get the stick? No. What about that thing? A faint sliver of light. Well, at least that's something. Oh. Um. Whoa! whoa. <laughs> I think. I, do we need a lantern or something? Probably. Oh, put maybe the <gasps> oh, monocle. You're right. Yes. Yes. Maybe put it. Huh. Yeah. We need some illumination. You don't think we combine it like with the ore or anything, do you? Because if we combine it with we the ore, we can stand it up and put it right. No, uh. that won't mix. Or maybe not. <laughs> no. I think we need like another thing, so we'll have to come back and look at that weird bug again. Uh, oh no. The wall is too high. Okay, get on the bus. Still quite high, Gavin. And I'm. Oh my God! Just go over there. That's still quite high, Gavin. And I'm wearing my. T Whatever, dude. Oh, what's this? Oh. I see. An Emerson and Burke portable steam plinth for elevating your opinion. <laughs> but how do I get on it? Oh. Yes. Elevated steam for your putting your opinion. So it's basically a very fancy like soapbox. Yeah. All right, here we go. The wall is too high. Oh my god. That's still quite high, Gavin. Oh. And I'm wearing my tight trousers. Oh, we need to find another thing. The wall is too high. The go, yeah. Man, this guy is very like particular about how high he will climb. What's this? What oh. are they? Very special. That's what they are. But I ain't got time for chitter chatter. Water is dripping everywhere. It's gonna be spoil everything. Hello, good sir. May I have a word? Hold on, Mister. My exotic produce is getting dripped on. I have to move it all. Right, Blooming State, I tell ya. Hmm. It's a bit fishy. <laughs> it's a pineapple. Ain't you never seen one before? Huh. Look at me, Ruth. It's in tatters. Not ten minutes ago, a huge pink bird, the sort I've never seen before, swooped down. It tried to get at me marrows. I only just managed to fight it off. Giant pink bird, you say? I wonder what that could have been. Great big flappy thing it were, with eyes like beetroot. Certainly wasn't our fault. No, 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 no. not at all. Or maybe not. Oh my <laughs> God! What about that tarp? No. See, it doesn't let me. The entrance to Lady Ravisham's secret garden. It looks a bit overgrown. I don't think anyone has been in here for quite some time. The lock is all seized up. We have a thing in Peru. A wise monkey does not need a door. Excellent idea, Gavin. Now, if only we had a monkey. Um. It's a good start. But I still can't reach. Hmm. And we can't just go in the front door. Uh. <laughs> All right. Hey, Harry, look at this. Yeah. Oh, look at that. A footstool. That will come in handy. Look at this picture over here. It's creepy. That is weird. 
the lesser spotted glump. Oh, what's that? That foot is broken off the chair. No. Oh dear. We can use the ore to walk across. Yes. No. No. This gaping chasm is too wide for me to leap across. Let's go back down then. Oh, you're taking forever to walk! Oh, you're taking so long, dying. Uh, hello. Why is everybody's candle so weird? I don't know. Hello, your ladyship. How are you? What's that? I can't hear a word you're saying. Yes? No, not you. What a dreadful racket. I can't hear myself think. Hey. Ah. Huh. I stole your stuff. Hello, your ladyship. How are you? What's that? I can't hear a word you're saying. Hmm. Oh. I don't think that will work. Hmm. No, click it on her. Oh. Like on her ear? Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's better. I can hear you now. Have you heard about the murderous villain known only as Jeff the Murderer? I, Bertram Fiddle, am hunting him down. You should be careful. Living on your own. Don't worry, young man. I have a feeling I shall be quite safe. Is there anything else you want? Squawk! Have you met Mr. Calamus? He's my only companion. I tell him all my secrets. Tells me all her secrets, but never remembers to feed me. Barely got the energy to lift my wings. Oh. Do we have any food? Uh, we have the head, oh, but that's it. Oh, that's a little, uh, <laughs> morbid. <laughs> hmm. Maybe we find some food for him. What a magnificent diamond. Look how it catches the light. Oh, uh, that thing. A mere trinket that has brought nothing but bad luck. A gift from someone I'd rather forget. Oh, okay. May it bring you better fortune than it has me. Wonderful. Thanks Thank for you. the huge diamond. Oh. Oh, is that you when you were young? That looks like it was painted a long, 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 long time ago. All right, All right easy. With a dish cabinet. Rummage in my drawers if you like, dearie. I've got nothing to hide. Okay, I will. Rummage in my drawers if you like, dearie. I've got nothing to hide. Hmm, do we have anything to use to jump? But well, now we can we light up that stool, so. And now we can light up that other place. I'm gonna go look at the weird bug. Yeah. Wait, what do you want to light it up with? The diamond. Oh. Yeah, it would be like a disco ball. And then we'll dance with the giant bug. Yes. You know that Garris technically has a carpus, right? Mm. Isn't that sexy? Like a giant cockroach? Yeah, he's a giant cockroach boyfriend. Carapace? Carapace boyfriend. Almost got it! I've... Oops, sorry, I keep accidentally clicking out of dialogue. This should help focus the light. Ah, makes me beam with pride. Oh, Dad! Oh. Hey, cool! Ah, my eyes! <sighs> I might hold on to this ring. It looks quite precious. Oh, no. Oh, oh I guess all right. I, oh. I, never mind. <laughs> the giant bug thing took it. Um. Oh. Hello. That's <sighs> gross and weird. Ew. Ah. Count Falchmuckle, I presume? I know what you're thinking, Fiddle. But it wasn't me this time. Are you eating a giant woodlouse? <laughs> you truly are a despicable man. Maybe I am, but we all have our little whimsies. What do you know about these murderings? 
I've heard rumors that the murderer will strike again. But I'm so hungry I cannot remember. Uh, he must be a worshipper of the yeah. Cthulhu, which is why the bugs are so big, because that shit happens. So. Yay! I guess. Uh. I've never smelled anything so disgusting in all my life. Cthulhu. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Cthulhu. Bless you. Uh, anything else we can Feed me, and I may be able to recall some details. What unimaginable thing could satisfy his hunger? A head? No, mm. we can't feed him that. We'll probably have to feed him a bug or oh. something. Oh, sense fear, fiddle. Are you afraid? They can strip a man to bones uh. in minutes. I've seen it. Okay, why do you hang out down here again? Count Falchmonko? Because so he's a, what, a vampire? What? I think that might be, he has those, like, he had glowing red eyes. Oh. He hates the light. He has that same, like, uh, outfit as what's his name did in Dracula. Do you remember? Where he was, like, stalking Nina and he was like, See me! And he was wearing those sunglasses. And he walks up to Nina like, hey, What's up? Nina, you want to like hang out? And she's like, no, go away. Oh. And he's like, I'm a prince. And she's like, okay, let's hang out. All right. That's better. Okay, so can, now can we go? Really? And now to nimbly scale the wall and make my way elegantly into the garden. Can't wait to see this. Yeah. I need further elevation. What? For real? Just, oh, just turn go the up. Get him to turn the thing. Oh. At your service. Ah. Wow. This guy. Oh, well. Are you okay, sir? You fell on something gross. Ew. Ew, uh, what is that? Uh, yes, yes, I'm fine. This toadstool broke my fall. Yes, toadstool. So this is Lady Ravisham's secret garden. It looks a bit neglected. A stout vine. I've swung on a few of these before. Ah. Uh... What fantastic flora. Such beautiful botany. Where are all the bees? What? That bush hasn't been pruned for years. Whoa! Oh. Look out, Gavin! It's alive! My goodness! Rhododendra carnivosa! Hmm, maybe the ore? It would just snap that in half! Its tendrils are too strong! Maybe get Gavin to do something? He said, watch mm. out, Gavin. Gavin! Watch yourself! This is a particularly perilous perimil! It's too precious. Stinky nettles! Hold your nose, Gavin! Mm. Uh. If only I had my jungle machete! Here's the problem. It was bolted from the inside. Well, see you later, monster. Yep. I guess we can just, uh, let's Come. go back inside here and see if we can find anything. Yeah, we're supposed to find the pictures, but... We just got sidetracked. <laughs> yeah, we have to get past that thing. See if we can find a weapon of some sort. Yeah, but we don't have a way to walk past that. Maybe I put... Oh, wait, hold on. I know. Oh, the rope! Yeah. yeah! The vine. We can get it and put it, yeah, on the chandelier. Because he said, I swing and across. And now to thing. leap yes. effortlessly across. <laughs> <laughs> I need a little more momentum. <laughs> oh my god. I need a little more mo- Gavin. Oh my god. Yes. Let me give you a push. <laughs> All tight, sir. You wait there, Gavin. I shall venture into the attic alone. Seems like a bad idea. 
And when he got there, the cupboard was, ooh, a biscuit. Hey! Whew. We can uh, feed An that guy's... An extremely old biscuit. The guy's unnatural desires with a biscuit. And he'd be like, oh, I could've just been eating normal foods. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! The horror! Hey, you know, if she is proud of herself, go ahead and do it. Yep. Ah, Lady Ravisham's chest. That's seen better days. The photomographs must be in here. Hmm, the lock is too strong. I need the combination. Wait, she tells the bird all her secrets. Give the biscuit to the bird. Ah, give me your secrets, bird. Well, how do I get back, though? Oh, I don't know. At your service. Pick me up. Oh. I need to bridge this gap somehow. <sighs> that won't work. I'll have to try something else. Wait, so go back up to the attic. There must be something in there that's like a permanent... Probably permanent that picture solution. of a bridge or something. You yeah. know what I mean? Yes. Yes. What a splendid panorama. It's almost as if you can step into the picture. Oh no, it's like a triple layered pun. <laughs> you know? Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, I love it. I was like, it's probably gonna be a picture of a bridge. Yes, it is. Oh my god. Can you put. You I need to bridge this gap. Yeah, somehow. put it actually onto the gap. Ah, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Love it. Shut up, game. This game is hilarious. <laughs> what are you talking about? This is just like... It's funny, but it's also like I want to punch it. Oh, that's better. Meet me in the attic. Why don't you just get out of here, bird? You're better than this. You're better than this, bird. I love that this game has voice acting. Yeah, I'm glad that we don't have to read everything. Yeah! <laughs> I feel like it really adds to the ah, setting. Yeah. Lady Ravisham's chest. That's seen better days. The photomographs must be in here. Hmm, the lock is too strong. I need the combination. I know the code. I know the code. One, eight, four, two. These must be what Lord Hearthwipe is after. I wonder why he wants them so badly. Um, ew. My dearest Clarabella, must, much as I am fond of you and your exquisite beauty, I have standing in society which I must preserve. This thing we made, I can't bring myself to say its name, is an abomination and must be sent away. Yours selfishly, Lord Arthwipe. P.S. Don't ever speak to me again. Do oh they... my. Oh. Now you know. Oh well, I better get back to the old turkey. She'd be wondering where I've gone. What'd you say? Do they have a kid? They probably have something gross. Like a monster in the garden or something. Oh, yeah. Because they said... I'm not farting, that's my stomach grumbling. Oh, I actually thought it was the humidifier. Oh, But well. now I know that you're farting, so. I'm not farting! It was my stomach making gurgly noises. It's the precursor to a fart. I would never freely let my butt fart unless it was going to be a silent one. God. If I was to fart around you, I would do it silently and then say, silent but deadly. And then what? you would say that it was the dog? No! When has there ever been a time where I didn't admit that I farted around you? Yeah, it's normally pretty obvious, too. I say, Stacy, I farted. It's gonna smell bad. You have to leave. It's not like I could get away with secretly with farts. We need a weapon or something to fight that thing. Yeah. Let's... Oh, well, let's... Yeah, you're right. Bring back the photos to the guy. No, we're supposed to meet him in the garden. Oh, we are? Yeah. No, but we can't get past the thing. 
You know what I mean? Oh. So we have to go. I. We have to go find other stuff. I think. Maybe we can show the pictures to the monster, and it gets grossed out. Oh. If this bush had eyes, these would surely scare it away. What if I just walk? If only I had my jungle machete. Yeah, so we might. I think we have to go back to the house. I don't know. No point going back that way. Oh, okay. So it has to be somewhere. And we there can't... was a sword. In oh wait, the... the ore on the panties. Can we take? Can we get it down with that? I do hope no one sees this. Think of the scandal. Thank God we got panties. May as well leave that here. See you later. Gate or oh, oh yes! We can give we can give that to the guy. Got them. Uh, Ooh, silky. Yes. To, uh, to the fruit guy, the guy who's selling fruit. He needs to, to cover up oh, his stuff. Oh yeah, I thought you meant like give it to the guy who needs something to eat. I was like, wow. And then okay. we can and then we can get the fruit and give it to the guy who needs something to eat. It's exotic fruit. And then he'll give us the sword, and then yeah. we can use the sword to. To kill the monster. Yep. Perfect. Try these on for size. Oh my Blooming god. Marvelous, sir. Blooming. Oh blimey, sir. I'm most humbly addicted to you. How can I ever repay you? See, because they're bloomers. <laughs> oh blimey, sir. I'm most humbly addicted to you. How can I ever repay you? Give me some fruit. Hello? Oh blimey, sir. I'm most humbly addicted to you. How can I ever repay you? Oh, this exotic shit. Yeah. What are they? Abigadodos! The world's rarest fruits. You can have one in return for helping me out. One good turn deserves another. <gasps> Thank you, good sir. Ew, it's all wiggly. All right, so now we got Yay! something weird for that guy who has weird, weird taste in food. First of all, why are there gigantic centipede or uh, roly polies in the roly polies? Yeah, what do you call them? Uh, it's it has a carapace. What is it called? It's a like a. I call them roly polies. Yeah, that implies like a caterpillar to me. Oh, cause when you know those bugs that roll up into a ball, roly polies. Caterpillars do that too, you know. Yeah, but you're not gonna touch a caterpillar. They these things, these things. When you were little, didn't you ever like poke them and they would turn no, into a ball? No, you poke those fuzzy caterpillars. Uh, no, because they don't have a carapace, so they can't protect themselves. You don't smush them. You just poke it. No, okay. So these things, when I was little, why would you touch that? That's disgusting. It, it looks like a cockroach. It's you touch it with a stick. It goes into a ball, and then you like roll it away. It's a roly poly. Great, so it's like throwing up all over itself while you're just giggling around, right? Well, I was four, okay? You were you a You know what my mom used to do? You were a horrible four year old. You know what my mom used to do? She what? used to pick up geckos with uh, chopsticks and just hold Eat them, them until their tail fell off because she was. <laughs> I mean, not the cycle, whatever. I'll fix that later. She was a mean lady, a lean, mean little girl, and one time she ate gecko eggs. Oh! <laughs> Here is your weird food. Ah, the forbidden fruit. There's nothing so delicious as that which is taboo. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. 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 <clears throat> what is wrong with you? If the living can't offer any clues, then maybe the dead can? Hmm? Tell me more. Do you know Sir Bruce and Lady Jane Wimpery? They are keen spiritomologists. And I know Sir Bruce has had need of special assistance in the past. I've heard of a gypsy lady who has such powers. 
Mayhaps you should seek her out. But be careful, Fiddle. You are meddling with things you can't imagine. Here, take this for protection. Oh, thank you. Leave me to my gluttony.